Within five years, most millennials do not expect to have a bank account. As people around the world have grown into a modern economy, they needed ways of transacting with each other. That's why we have a system that's sort of the way it is today. It's very old, it's very slow, and it is totally obsolete. In the last year alone, there have been multiple examples of countries that have mismanaged their financial systems. You can look at Argentina or Venezuela or Greece or Crete or Ukraine. These are places that have increasingly weak trust in institutions. So if there are 2.5 billion people without access to financial services, you've got 4 billion people without access to credit cards, and you've got millennials don't expect to have bank accounts, how are all these people going to transact with each other in the future? So. There's a new innovation called blockchain, which essentially you can call it a transaction network. Transaction networks have three things in order to function. You've got to have some type of currency on that network. You have to have a trusted ledger to keep track of who owns what. And if I send someone a transaction, I have to know it goes through. It's cost efficient, it has way stronger security, and it's totally transparent. If everybody has a smartphone, everybody has a bank on their phone, everybody can start to do commerce with each other. You can start to track more than just money in it. One of those things could be diamonds, or art, or a title to your car. Remember, 10 years ago, we didn't have iPhones yet. So the pace at which this technology is accelerating is immense. We're expecting the world to get more interconnected. All of the appliances we have in our homes will start to negotiate and talk with each other. In order for that world to come, we have to have a transaction network that's affordable to use, that anybody can access, that supports micro transactions. The blockchain is an open invitation to participate in an open, fair, and accessible financial future for everybody. It is the most important thing happening on Earth right now.